you know what it is. It's forklift truck racing. Oh yeah. Hello people of the internet, welcome back to the Onbar Arcade and welcome back to Shenmue, get out of my way. So this is episode 8. Most Let's Play series would be finished now, but Shenmue is a game of waiting around for things to happen and uh, slow progress, so we are probably got another three episodes or so to go, at least. We're trying to get a job in the harbour, so we've been told to meet a dude, well, Goro, he's a dude, uh, by the gates of warehouse number one. We've arrived a little early, so I'm just gonna run laps until midday. Here he is. Yo, Our favorite I Yankee is back. Job, really? Thanks. <laughs> he sounds so unappreciative. You know, I had to go through quite a lot of hassle for you though, bro. Cheers. what you say? That'd be the job I found. Who's Shut this? Lip, woman? Hello, my. Oh, it's Mai, Hi, who we hey. apparently know, but we've never met before. Airhead here asked me to find it for you. I'm always delivering lunch to Harbor Dorm, so I asked the foreman I know for you. Batting her little eyes like, oh, pretty please, Mr. Foreman, huh? Ow! So, where should I go? Be at the Alpha Trading Office by 2 p.m. Just ask for Yara-san. You have an appointment. I've got an appointment. 2 p.m. Yeah. Yadasan, Alpha Trading Office. Thanks a lot. See ya. To the trading office. Some funky music here. Excuse me. What do you want? What do you Are want? You Yada -san? Yeah, that's me. My son at the lunch stand mentioned me. Oh yes, my from the lunch stand. This is how normal yes, people did. talk. Can you start right away? Yes. Suppose. I mean, he's got nothing else to do, is he? What else will we see Rio do apart from buy toy capsules and wait around? You, uh, ever drive a forklift? No. No, sir. Uh, well. Break Time to start. It'll be deducted. Yes. You break it, you bought it. Hey, Mark! Come here a sec! Okay, boss. Zoom. Okay, Mark will take it from here. I see. Mark, show him how to drive the forklift. Okay, boss. Hello, I'm Ryo Hazuki. I'm Mark. Hey, man, I'm Mark. I'm sure we'll get along just fine. Driving the forklift, it's easy. <laughs> get the hang you of don't need a quick. license or anything. Oh, okay. Driving a forklift, oh, it's easy, man. There's no regulations or anything. You know, it's 80s Japan. You'll be fine. You won't kill anyone. Next, press the accelerator. No, no, that's reverse. No, it's not. The accelerator. I went forwards. Press Are the you blind? Harder. Are you blind? How long Mark. is this going to take? Mark. Okay, good. What does he want now from me? Up. Different from accelerating. Going backwards is different yeah, from accelerating. You'll have to slow down, Mark. I don't understand. Wrong one. What do you mean, wrong one? He's not telling me any buttons. He's just going, nah, that's wrong. Y you've done it wrong. Okay, not too bad. Now, you try moving that crate. Take that crate to warehouse number three. Just there. First, slide the fork under the crate. Yeah, I know how a forklift works. Lift the crate and go. It's the driving part that I'm inexperienced at. Sweet. Right, I better put the rest of these in here. Uh, looks like it's time for a montage, I think. One more. Surely not. Finished for the day. No! I nearly had it. Oh, good work. Thank you. You're getting used to the forklift. 
I suppose so. About your wage. You start at 300 yen per crate. 300 yen a crate? You There's a quota every He's overpaying day, me. So don't go slacking off. Yes, sir. If you do good enough and meet quota, I'll give you a raise. Oh, I want a raise. I understand. Well, good luck. Thank you very much. Well, that's gone rather well, hasn't it? We can start earning. Maybe we can buy a ticket to Hong Kong just through our earnings instead of trying to find out about the Mad Yo. Angels, which is basically Mark, fruitless. I need you to come tomorrow at 9 a.m., okay? 9 a.m.? You're having a laugh yeah, in you, mate? Sure. I started at midday today. There's something we gotta do before work. Oh, no. Pre-work work. They're really before relentless work. in Japan, really? aren't they? Yeah, man. They got pre-work work, post-work work. You'll see when you get here. Oh, and don't be late. I'm never late, okay. mate. They call me on-time Hazuki. It's like Vulcan no-time Ozdemir. He's Ryo on-time Hazuki. You know, it's, it's, that's just his name. So Ryo's given us a pretty strong hint that we shouldn't just go back home and sleep. We should have a little look around the harbour. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> Something's happening. Stay out of here, old man. <laughs> I'm gonna run you over! <laughs> I guess that somebody's got to be me. Get out! Who the hell are you? Who the hell are Quit you? Terrorizing him. Look at him. Talks like a goody-goody little shit. All right then. We'll just play you. What? How about you? Yeah, what? Race that didn't make any sense. Motorcycle? A chicken race. You do know what that is, right? Okay. I'll play your little game. But if I win, you leave him alone. He'll give the signal. Well, this has got exciting. This can hits the ground. Here we go. Here goes. Take that. Uh. <laughs> give up yet? Hey, you. Whoa, lucky son of a. I'm pressing these buttons. You I don't know quite what it is about the uh, PS4 version of Shenmue, but it just doesn't respond to QTE it buttons at all, really. Day. We'll let you off this time. Don't mess with him again. Anyway, we did it. You'd best watch your mouth, boy. This is our territory. And watch your back, too. Watch my mouth and my back. How many eyes do you think I have? Well, I suppose now it's time to go home. Now that sequence has occurred, we're allowed to uh, leave the dockyard. But before that, no way, bro. Anyway, we're going to get the bus and we're going to go home and we're going to sleep. And we're going to go back to work, because that's how life works. Um, next time, okay, kid? Right. This guy's not taking any of our shit. Just going to wait for the bus right next to his face. I mate. Alright. You good? You alright? Yeah? Oh, look, he's got a bloke the other side doing it as well. Ha, <laughs> we've got him sandwiched. Yes, mate. Time to, uh, jump the queue. Oh no, we're gonna wait for them because apparently we're really polite. It's time for bed. Morning. My new job starts today. I'm glad you've remembered. So we're gonna try and collect information about the Mad Angels while at work. Let's see what the pre-work work is. You know what it is. It's forklift truck racing. Oh, yeah. Good morning, everyone. Morning. Morning, Mark. Time for a daily warm-up race. You all do your best now. Yeah. 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 Like always, three laps to the finish. Everybody ready? Oh, I'm ready. And don't go wrecking the forklifts or the formula have your ass. Yeah. 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 On your marks, almost time to go. That's not how it goes. It's on your marks, set, go. Not on your marks, almost time Ready? to go. But close go. enough, I guess. Right, here goes. And we are away in the Forklift Grand Prix. Ryo Hazuki coming up the inside here for the overtake. But he's got stuck. Oh, no. 
you got to take the turns quite wide because you can get stuck on things on the inside of turns and that's no good. We've got driving rock music behind us. We're going to oh, nearly dive bomb city. We're not going to dive bomb city just yet. We've got a horn, I think. So we can toot them if we're feeling extra, uh, extra salty. We're doing okay. We're up into third. P3 here. The racing game strats are coming out. The NASCAR strats. This is the uh, road course, of course. It's not a roval. Heading up into second place here. It's a flat drag race. A very slow drag race. But it's Dive Bomb City from the outside. Coming up on first place here. We're going to do it. There is a prize for coming first as well. So you do want to come first if you can. We're going to try and slipstream him not really working because we've all got the same top speed and there is no slipstream physics in Shemu because I mean why would they want to put that in out my way oh could have gone for dive bomb city I think I'll wait for the obvious shortcut though that's the place we're going to overtake him and Ness oh could we dive bomb now no nope. didn't want to get stuck on the edge that's what you got to watch out for. When you're racing hard, you can get stuck on the edges of stuff and left completely behind. So you want to race pretty conservatively for the most part. A little bit of rubber banding going on here, I think. But as we come round here... Oh, oh no. Yeah, we might have to take second place here. We're going to try and drag him to the line. Oh, we're going to run Mark over. We came second. Okay, that's fine. The reason that's fine is because there's a prize for every finishing position. Oh, man. So close. You almost had it. And it's better to Here's get all drive. of them. Thanks. Time to get to work. Move these crates with the forklift. Where do I take them? Warehouse number 18. Here's the route map. The quote is written on the map. Ten crates. If you exceed quota, you'll get a raise. Well, I want to get a raise. Just be sure you don't break anything. I never okay. break. When do, when do I break things? Like apart from that plate in Master Chen's warehouse, I did break that. Here we go. Lift it and reverse. Now warehouse number eighteen. That is round here. No. We gotta find it first, and then we'll uh, be able to do it super quickly and get our raise. I think, yeah, 1 to 17, 18's here, right, cool. We know it's just round the corner as well, this is gonna be super convenient for getting a lot of crates during the day. Are you ready for a montage? I think you are. So we have smashed the quota already. We've got, I think this is the 12th crate we're going to put in there. So 12 crates by lunchtime. We were supposed to do 10 all day. I mean, we could slack off later on, but I sort of want to earn some money. Oh, we've got to put this one down before 12, though. Yes. Okay, there we go. That's 12 crates before 12 o'clock. Celebratory 2, and it's lunchtime. Is Mark eating his lunch? Some music. Hey, my lunch! That's his you lunch! Ran this out, didn't you? Are you one of Chen's men? I don't know any Chen. Oh, oh, right. <laughs> I don't know. That was such a tame oh. kick, and hey, he's like been killed. Yeah, cut it out. Are Rio's ready to defend what his new work, mate? Twin? We're gonna teach you a lesson. That was more breath than it was line. Oh hi, it's a free battle. Nice, I get to show off my skills. Hold on, uh, where's the run button? Whoa, not the fly button. It's, it's quite easily countered this kick, but it's it's worth doing. Here we go. Right, Rio's getting his stride on. These guys are pretty tough though, I'll give them that. They've survived our moves thus far. 
But you can't beat Ryo Hazuki. Unless your name's Chai and you're in an arcade to eat a Hong Kong ticket. It's a long story. Half their moves are defensive. Just like parries. There we go. Absolutely murdered him. Oh, remember this. Well, you better. You better remember this. That's why you don't kick people's lunch into the Thank sea. You, Leo. Who were they? They were the mad angels. I want to talk to them. Why are the mad angels picking on you? They seem to think I'm working with one of their enemies. Uh, you sort of are. Chen. Chen, eh? That name but rings a bell. Him. Master Chen and the Mad Angels. Don't say it so loud, Rio. How long is my lunch time? Because it's one o'clock, but we don't have to get back on our forklift yet, do we? Do we have a two hour lunch break? Finally, it's time to get back to it's work. It's this late. Warehouse number 18. Okay. He's not the most motivated individual, is he? So we're just delivering the penultimate crate, but here's hey boy. one you of the mad angels. Hard, eh? Okay. What? You ain't paid your what? insurance. That ain't right. Law of the harbor dictates all rookies gotta pay insurance. You know what I'm saying? Medical insurance or liability what insurance? insurance? I said pay up, boy, right now. You guys don't look like a Viva. You guys mad angels? Defiance ain't a good idea. You don't pay up, boy. I'm gonna kick your ass. No way. That's fighting you are talk. Gonna regret that decision. Oh, they're far too easy. They're way too easy to beat. These guys can't really be mad angels, come on. You know, I'm taking time out of my shift here to fight you. You could at least fight back. Didn't even lose much health. Damn I think it. we lost half a bar. All right, you guys. No! Hey, wait! No! <laughs> Well, I guess that was that. They were mad angels. Uh, we beat them up, so uh, maybe we'll be seeing some more of them later on. That's our penultimate crate. We've got one more to go. To be fair, this is a pretty easy route. I assume the routes are going to get a little bit harder. Well, I know the routes are going to get a little bit harder as we continue with this job. They've given us a pretty easy one. We were supposed to do 10 crates. I think we've done 18 as far as I know, maybe 20. Uh, but they're all in there. Now, I think we finish at 5, so we have completely overperformed. We've completely exceeded expectations there. That is the final crate. Uh, yeah, we have about an hour to roam around the harbour with nothing to do because we've done our job. Can I take that one off you, mate? Let me let me take that one off you. Come on, give it, give it here. Give it here. Give it... Ah, oh, for goodness sake, man. Not to toot my own horn, but... There's literally nothing to do for an hour. We just drive the forklift around, not crashing it into people, because you can't. You can't even pick other stuff up. You can only move the prongs up and down in the hopes that something will happen. And stop doing donuts. Finished for the day. So a pure hour of doing donuts in his forklift, and uh, he's finished for the day. Okay, good job. Here's today's pay. Mate, the job's too easy. Can you give me more crates? Thanks. You met quota, son. 
So starting tomorrow, you'll get a 50 yen raise. I smashed quota, That'll you mean? 350 yen per crate. Oh, we'll be going to Hong Kong in Thank no you. time. Keep up the good work. Cheers. Here's Goro. Yo, bro! Hats off to the hard working man! Oh. You said you knew a lot about the harbor. Right on, my man! From the perfect mugging locale to the best bot to take a leak! This here harbor, Goro knows it all! So you know about the Mad Angels? Oh, uh, I. Speaking of taking a leak! Goro! Not so fast. Oh, man! Must have had me a bad ache this morning! Gotta hit the can, my man! Oh, hope I can make it in time! Oh! So you know about them. That name. Please don't say it so loud. They're not Voldemort. Why not? You get yourself fed to the fishes for talking about the man. It's taboo around here. There's a rumor about some loudmouth kid who got himself concrete boots for talking. No way. Well, bro, I'm out of here. See you around. So the Mad Angels yeah, are basically later. the Mafia then. Some dude's got concrete boots for saying the word Mad Angels and now everyone's a bit scared of them. Well, not me. Oh, what's going on here? Hello? There's music. But it's just Rio walking, you know? Nothing weird about this. Hopefully. What's gonna happen? <sighs> Why are you attacking me? Your Master Chen's son were on the same team. Lisa, you never know when to give up, do you? What do you want? I want to go Hong Kong. I'm here to teach you a new move. What for? Mike, that'll be real helpful. It might be. It could be a good move. You couldn't even handle the Mad Angels, much less take on Landy. I'd handle the Mad Angels twice today. Look, I don't need your help. Hey, fine by me, but it's wise to accept the goodwill of others. So, what will it be? You are mine or not? I mean, I guess. Oh, we can decline? Well, why not? Let's learn the well, move. you're so eager to teach me. Okay. And now it's time to go home. So we want to come anything but second in today's race. And I aim for first, but if I don't quite get there, I can fall back on third, fourth or fifth. Hopefully we'll be right behind him when we go through the shortcut so we can uh, cut off the distance and gain first place for the first time in forklift racing. Oh, here we go, Dive Bomb City, bitch! There we go, look at that. Hey Mark, I'm leading! First place, yeah! Finish! Woo! Look at that arm go, super gadget arm! Pretty damn good for a rookie. Pretty damn good. Here's your first place prize. Thanks. It's the number one forklift truck. Now we've just got to do crap in the next three days of work and we'll have them all. Oh, I do. You know I do. Today, you got to take this cargo to warehouse number three. We've got to take eight crates from just outside the tomato convenience store to warehouse number three. I think we can do that. Let's raise the prongs. And away we go. It's obviously time for another montage.
See, considering the distance we've had to cover, seven crates by lunchtime is not bad at all. We've got a quota of eight crates, so we'll uh, maybe double it. Maybe not quite, but it'll be a good payday nonetheless. It's lunchtime. lunchtime eh? Oh, lunchtime, eh? Now, the thing is about this lunchtime, uh, there's literally nothing that you can do relating to the Mad Angels. There's no QTEs you can trigger, there's no fight sequences you can trigger. It's literally a free lunchtime. Who says there's no such thing as a free lunch? Maybe I can practice here. I should work on my moves. Let's work on our moves. That's enough. So it's back to our job, to I work. guess. This entire day so far has been a waste. Amazing. Oh, something's gonna happen, is it? It's about time. Hey, look! It's schoolboy! You guys. What the hell are you doing here? I work here. Children shouldn't play around with forklifts. You might get hurt, you know. There's literally no Come labor on. laws in Japan, apparently, so it's fine. Right. You heard us? You're fired. Ha! <laughs> nice taxi you got here. Take me on home, okay? Can we not Get just crush him? On. Whatever. Raise the forklift. Raise that box into like something high up and just crush that man and be like, "Sorry, you're in my way, mate." Oh no, the shutter's closed. Guess I'll have to fight these dudes. That's fine. I'm fine with this. Hey, cut it out. Joke's on you, schoolboy. That's it. You're mine. It's showtime! Alright, Anthony Pettis is gonna fight us then. Pretty soon after the Tony Ferguson fight, Anthony, what are you doing? Our new technique that uh, Guizhang taught us in a moment. Just got to beat up a few of these other guys so that they don't get in the way of it. There we go. The more people that are on a fight, the less health they generally each have. So, as you might be able to tell with this one, the guys are pretty weak. Oh, here's another dude, and there he goes. Oh, he's back again. He gets knocked down, but he gets up again. You're never going to keep him down. Unless you destroy his liver, in which case, yeah, you are. You're going to keep him down. It's the bass rooting strats. Oh, there's more dudes. No problem. Considering our health just recharged, it should be fine. There we go, we've just absolutely destroyed everyone. So I guess the Mad Angels are all dead, yeah? Uh, oh man. Hey, help me! We are doing the Kiryu thing of defeating like 10 Mad people Angels? at a time. Those guys are at the back of warehouse number 17. You mean these number aren't 17? the Mad Angels? Yeah, at the back of the warehouse. Yeah, at the back of warehouse 17, I get it. You lying? No! If you don't believe me, go Why see Why would he be yourself. lying? <coughs> are we not gonna finish our day of work? Oh, we are. Okay, good. I wanna get paid, you know? It's like 4.30, so they've wasted a fair amount of our work time with that bollocks. We can maybe get two more crates in, I think. Let's go for two. We'll try and grab two crates before five o'clock. 
Try and get the maximum number of yen possible. And then we can maybe buy a ticket to Hong Kong. Don't know, get out of my way. Get what? Don't run into my forklift. It is a dangerous piece of heavy machinery. They just don't understand. See, we've mastered the uh, running into the boxes and lifting them up in the same fluid motion. That's pretty speedrun strats right there. I mean, I don't know if there's a way to skip this entire section in a speedrun or whether you just zoom about at your leisure, I don't know. Shenmue speedruns are weird, it's like eight hours or something. I think some of the best runs are, so you just sit there while the game does it. I think a popular thing is to complete Shemu 1 and 2 at the same time, so that while you've got a cutscene in 1, you can be playing 2 and... I don't know, I mean, that's that's just crazy, you know, that you can do that. Are we going to get this final crate? There's like 10 minutes left in the day. I feel like it's not going to be enough time for us to go and get this crate, but we'll give it a... We'll give it a go. That's so it, we need our forks down on the ground. Oh, I don't think we've got enough time here. It's going to be super tight if we even get there. Ah, oh, the strats though, look at the driving. Surely they'll pay us for one that's like right near warehouse number three. You've got to pay me for this, come on. I took it like halfway, at least pay me half. Finished for the day. Okay, good job. Here's today's pay. It's gonna be quite a lot, I think. We did like 10, Thanks. maybe more. You met quota, son. So starting tomorrow, you'll get a 50 yen raise. That'll be 400 yen per crate. Oh, we're really gonna be rolling Thank in you. the money now. Keep up the good work. We're really gonna be rolling in the money yes. now. Thank you very much. Anyway, this is going to just about do it for this episode of Shemu in the Armbar Arcade. Uh, Rio is going to follow his leads next episode. He's done two hard days of work. Uh, he's done grafting on his forklift. He's done far more than has been expected of him in terms of hitting quota. He needs a good rest now. So if you've liked this video, leave a like. If you're new here in the Armbar Arcade, subscribe and click the bell to be notified every time we upload a video. Leave in the comments the most time wasting you ever had to do in a video game because it's getting silly, isn't it? It is getting silly. And I will see you next time in the Armbar Arcade.